know, what were you learning in those final restarts that you tried to, to implement in the last one? Well, I thought I thought it was a little better than the than, than Kyle and the 18 guys uh, with new tires for five, seven laps or so. When the longer run, he was better than me. He was just turning better for whatever reason. I was getting too tight and, and I was trying to so just my my tools as much as I can to to free the car up a little bit, but it wasn't helping you know the rotation what I needed. Uh, and every restart, I feel like I was that was decent, but not not great. Uh, I feel like if I was able to complete the pass by third corner one, I was gonna be able to hold him up. But I, I just never had the, the help from the time. You started from pole for the first time in your cup career. Your crew chief, Scott Graves, told me the important thing was to learn from this, no matter how it played out. Did, how valuable was the experience today? It was good. Uh, in the beginning of the race, we're okay. And then we lost the balance a little bit. We made some adjustments. We got the car better. And by the end of the race, I thought we, we were a solid top three car, uh, top five car. I felt like in the short run, we were actually the best car out there. I was better than 18 on this, and uh, it was a little disappointing. It hurts to be close. Thank you. And after all that, fourth for the four car. What a day, Kevin, starting in the back, going to the front, then back to the back again. How would you describe it? Well, just a, a really fast mobile one forward. You know, I think as you, as you look at the day, we kept having to go to the back and make a good race out of it. Um, you know, it's just it's hard to swallow having a car like that and not winning, but that's usually how it goes. Uh, when, you, when you have a have a day uh, where your car runs that fast, you just got to thank everybody. Stuart Haas Racing, uh, Racing, Roush Yates, Engines, uh, Jimmy Johns, Ford, Mobile One, uh, Bush, Outback, Hunt Brothers, Morton, Textron, uh, Liftmaster, everybody who uh, makes this car go around. So just uh, ran out of laps. You knew you were the car to be. You described it that way. What could you have done differently? Well, I got it on pit road and I started in the back. You watched the race. You tell me. A lot of things added up to a, a non-win today for Kevin. A career best finish for Alex Bowman, who brings the 88 car home third. Alex, take me through those final restarts and how you were able to gain some of those final two positions. Yeah, I felt like our car was really solid on restarts all day. And anytime you restart on the outside here, you can kind of take advantage of some people under the tunnel. So we were able to do that. Um, that last restart wasn't the best. I couldn't get Kyle's rear bumper. I think we had some gear ratio differences there, but um, still a good solid day. Spotter did a good job all day, and um, ended shop, Cassie shop, everybody back home. Really appreciative for the uh, the, the continual improvement because uh, it's been a while since we've run this good. Yeah, how promising to see not just you finish in the top five, but a few spots behind you is William Byron, Chase Elliott, that the whole company is running better. Absolutely, it's great. Um, you know, we really struggled all weekend until today, and uh, then the boss showed up. So maybe Mr. Hendricks just needs to come to every single race, and we'll. we'll all run better but um, you know it's uh, kind of some light at the end of the tunnel we didn't uh, have the raw speed that looked like the nine car did we were a little off um, but you know anytime that all four of us are running better is a good week for us thank you Alex. Uh, victory lane they're about to